Hello and welcome to the Game Dev Outpost. In this video, we'll be importing 3D into Unreal 4. If you're looking for importing animation, that'll be in another video. Unreal has two 3D file types that'll accept, FBX and OBJ. There's three different ways that you can import. You can click on the import button, or you can copy your files directly to the project folder, or you can just drag and drop them into the engine. Now Unreal usually does a good job of interpreting what you're trying to import, but I'd like to point out a few things in the import settings. So auto generate collision, if you're importing a model and you don't have any custom collision, this is gonna be ticked on by default and you can't turn it off. And then if for whatever reason when you're importing it and you wanna offset the translation or rotation, maybe change the scale, you can do that. And then another important one is convert scene. You're gonna want this ticked on. You're converting the FBX coordinate system to the Unreal 4 coordinate system. In the materials, this is kind of a personal preference, but I make sure that I turn off creating materials and I also turn off importing textures. We usually prefer to import them separately. Now, if you click import and you wanna change some of those settings, you don't have to worry, they're not gone. If you double click on your imported model, it'll open up a window for editing your mesh. And in here, on the right hand corner under details, you'll see import settings. And under here are all of the same settings that you had before. If you do change any of these settings, you're gonna to wanna to re-import your mesh. And there's two different ways that you can do that. You can come up here in this window to the left hand corner and click on re-import base mesh, or you can go back to where your file is and you can right click and you can click on re-import. Now you do have another option in here, which is re-import with a new file. So if for whatever reason you need to reconnect the source to this file, you can do that. Now to see these files show up in your project folder, you're gonna to have to save them. And once you do that, you'll be able to see that when you imported these files, they're converted into a file type known as uasset. This is a file type that holds your model file and your import settings. Another useful option that you have is if you right click on your model and you go down to asset actions, you can re-export your model if you need to. And it'll export it out as the proper file type as it was before it was converted to a U asset. All right, as we get to more relevant topics, we'll cover more of this mesh edit window, but this should cover importing 3D into Unreal 4. If this video is useful, please let me know by commenting down below and liking the video. Thanks guys.